This is the grade eight math practice test for TN Ready. Currently, in this version of the test, this is question number nine. What is the value of B for B squared equals 36 over 64? Now, you're trying to find B and you're given B squared. So let's just look at that as an idea first. To get from here to here, what do I need to do? Well, I need to do the opposite operation of square, which is square root. So that means I need to take whatever this is and take the square root of both. As a strategy, I would say if I have scrap paper and I'm at this level of math, I'm probably spending a little bit of time going ahead at the very beginning. Unless you're just super solid at them. And writing this sort of thing down. On that same scrap paper on the other side, I might actually do this as well. Just to sort of balance it out. That whole thing took about a minute to do both of those sets, but now I have a tool that I can use throughout the test that might save me a bunch of time or more likely save me from making basic mistakes. So I need to do the square root of 36 over 64. The nice thing is you can do the numerator separate from the denominator. And since I have my fancy dancy lists, I just go to find the square root of 36. There it is, it's 6. And then I find the square root of 64. It's right there, it's 8. And since they're not asking me to reduce, apparently, that's my final answer. So my answer to number 9 is R. Not that complicated, but taking the time to have both of these charts ready at the beginning of the test might make it a lot easier as you move through. Uh, in a previous question, we had to look at, well, what happens if you have the square root of 2 or the square root of 3? Well, having this chart ahead of time would help me know that, well, Square root of 2 and 3 is between these two, so it's probably somewhere between 1 and 2. And we applied some logic to say, like, well, let's just do 1 and a half every time to save time. And uh, same with the square root of 6 and 7 being between these, so we applied 2.5. But I could only make these and not have to do it each time. It would save me a bunch of uh, thought, maybe. So it's a good idea to do it.